It's 10 trivia questions on the hit Food Network series, Good Eats, for Patreon subscriber Donald Fuller. This is Trivia with Buds. Be and welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out the show and thanks for supporting the show on Patreon. Patreon.com slash trivia with buds is the place to go. It's linked in all the show notes wherever you're listening from. Go check it out. See all the cool rewards and things you can get for just being a subscriber. Now there's different tiers. And I want to give a big shout out to my friend Tanya Charles and her husband CJ, who play bingo with me every Monday night at Gypsy Circus Cidery in Kingsport, Tennessee. Thank you guys so much for signing up for the Patreon at the $30 a month level. At $30 a month, they get access to lots of cool things I post on Patreon, special whole trivia nights you can play at home. Uh, They get to pick a topic that I do in the podcast every month, and they get a monthly collectible, like a Funko or a bendable toy or something like that, that I will personally hand deliver to them because I see them every single month or every single week, rather, um, for their prize once a month. Uh, So thank you guys so very much. But you can sign up at any tier between $1 and $50. You can see them all at patreon.com slash trivia with buds. A dollar gets you a thank you and your name in every show notes to every episode. And there's over 2,300 episodes at this point. So thank you, thank you, thank you for your support. Due to big charity bingo show this weekend to benefit Waiting to Hear. Want to give a shout out to them? Go check out waitingtohear.org and consider donating to help deaf kids in Northeast Tennessee get cochlear implants and hearing related services that they need in this region. They also put on a couple of excellent summer camps that are totally free of charge for these children and their families. So check it out, waitingtohear.org. We have three warm-up questions before we get to 11 questions on Good Eats with Alton Brown. Here are those warm-up questions. What sitcom did Tom Hanks star on for two seasons before finding fame in the movie Splash? That was none other than Bosom Bite, <laughs> Bosom Buddies, Bosom Bites. That's like a some sort of roommate vampire show. But Bosom Buddies is the answer. Your next one here is what Florida theme park unleashed an indoor roller coaster called Revenge of the Mummy? That is Universal Studios in Orlando, Florida. Return Revenge of the Mummy. I don't think I've ridden that. And how about this one? What rocker rounded up Gary Coleman, Cato Kalin, Corey Feldman, and the Toxic Avenger for his We Are All Made of Stars music video? That is DJ Moby. Moby had that song and all those celebrity cameos in the music video for We Are All Made of Stars. And we are ready to rock and roll with Good Eats. Hopefully you've seen this show. It's a fun one. We're going to do 11 questions on that topic for Donald Fuller. Here we go. It's Good Eats. Question number one. What year was the first episode of Good Eats released on the Food Network? Number one, what year was the first episode of Good Eats released on the Food Network? Question number two. Alton Brown's daughter appeared on his show several times. What was her name? Number two. Alton Brown's daughter appeared on Good Eats several times. What was her name? Number three, what kind of creature lives inside Alton's fridge and teaches safety? What kind of creature lives inside Alton's fridge and teaches safety? Question number four, on a 2010 episode, how many pounds did Brown claim to lose in nine months? Number four, on a 2010 episode of Good Eats, how many pounds did Brown claim to lose in nine months? Number five, instead of saying, see you next time on Good Eats, what did Brown say to close out the final episode of the 2011 run? Instead of saying, see you next time on Good Eats, what did Brown say to close out the final episode of the 2011 run? Number six, on what streaming service did Good Eats The Return, season two, air exclusively in 2021? On what streaming service did Good Eats The Return, season two, air exclusively in 2021? Number seven, what were the names of the two lawyers who would appear to talk about copyrights and laws on Good Eats? What were the names of the two lawyers on Good Eats? 
Question number eight, what was the name of the farmer who prided himself on homegrown produce? Number eight, what was the name of the farmer who prided himself on homegrown produce? And number nine, what was unique about the filming of season nine starting in 2005? What was unique about the filming of season nine starting in 2005? Question number 10, what horror movie is parodied in the episode Give Peas a Chance? What horror movie is mocked in the episode Give Peas a Chance? And your bonus question, Good Eats is the third longest running Food Network show. Name either of the first two. Good Eats is the third longest running Food Network show. Name either of the first two. Those are all your questions on the hit series Good Eats from Food Network. We'll be right back with the answers after this. We are back with the answers to Good Eats trivia. Donald Fuller, let's see how you did. Number one, what year was the first episode of Good Eats released on the Food Network? That was 1999, although some of the episodes, I think, were produced in 98 for, like, local access. And uh, and then Food Network bought them and started airing them in 99. Number two, Alton Brown's daughter appeared on his show several times. What was her name? Zoe. Zoe. Number three, what kind of creature lives inside Alton's fridge and teaches safety? That's a garden gnome. Garden gnome. Number four on a 2010 episode, how many pounds did Brown claim to lose in nine months? That was 50 pounds, 50 pounds. Number five, instead of saying, see you next time on Good Eats, what did Brown say to close out the final episode of the 2011 run? Stay dark, America. Stay dark, America. Number six, on what streaming service did Good Eats The Return Season 2 air exclusively in 2021? That was Discovery Plus. Discovery Plus is going to become part of HBO Max, I just read, very soon this year. So if you miss all those shows and don't have them, but you have HBO Max, you'll be able to watch all these uh, classic shows like Good Eats. Number seven, what were the names of the two lawyers who would appear to talk copyrights? Itchy and Twitchy. Itchy and Twitchy. Number eight, what was the name of the farmer who prided himself on homegrown produce? Farmer McGregor like Peter Rabbit, Farmer McGregor. Number nine, what was unique about the filming of season nine starting in 2005? It was the first to be shot in high definition, first in HD. Number 10, what horror movie is parodied in the episode Give Peace a Chance? The Exorcist. Peas, throwing up peas, uh, et cetera, the green vomit from The Exorcist and uh, peas mentioned in that episode. And number 11, Good Eats is the third longest running Food Network show. Name either of the first two. It's 30 Minute Meals or The Barefoot Contessa. 30 Minute Meals or the Barefoot Contessa. And there you have it, a fun episode requested by one of our Patreon subscribers. If you want to request an episode, just join at the $5 a month or higher tier, and I'll send you the link to fill out all your topics monthly through the end of 2023 in a big Google spreadsheet. And I would love to have you on board. If you've been listening for a while, think about becoming a Patreon subscriber in 2023. We're up to 79 supporters And I would love for you to be number 80. Wouldn't that be cool for just a buck? You should do it. Patreon.com slash trivia with buds. Fact of the day is giving birth in the U.S. is more than 20 times as lethal as skydiving. Oh, boy. Jumping out of a plane and pushing a baby out. You wouldn't think that uh, the baby is more dangerous, but it is. And now you know. Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend. And we'll see you next time for more trivia with buds. Cheers. (music) 